Hello, Miguel, how are you? Oh, hi, Michael. Can, can I'm you fine. hear me? No, no, I hear you. So today's topic is, is about the, the old style of the Soviet flats uh, compared to what you would see in today's uh, flats. So some, some people keep tradition in terms of the old Soviet style and, and some people like the, the American style, which I think is hard to do because... Uh, most people in in Ukraine live in a in a, fl in a flat, and uh, furniture that's in America is often bigger. A in America, we have a couch, couch? right? You know, a, a big a big couch. I don't know what is it. Couch. One second. Here's a p good picture of what I mean. Oh, uh, okay, I see. It's like a d divan, <laughs> you know. Like a what? Divan in Russian. Uh, uh, but am, am I right? Most flats in Ukraine don't have uh, a big couch. No, am I right? No. Yes. No. I know. I I think uh, maybe uh, um, it is different uh, words so far. Uh, sofa uh, and couch, yes. It's a different. Sitting. It's a different subject. It's same. There's no difference between a sofa and a couch. I think we uh, maybe all, all flat uh, have. Has. Has, uh, has a couch. Has a couch, yes. But you you mean you mean the ones that can convert into a bed. Yes, it's like uh, I I don't know. Uh, uh, yes, convert uh, can convert uh, to 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 bed. You're right. Did Did you see the picture I sent you? One second. Uh huh. I see. That that's that's a couch. That's mm -hmm. what I'm talking about. Mm hmm. You and mean? Uh, you mean uh, the coach which uh, don't transform uh, to 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 another uh, <laughs> subject to to like not not a bed, uh, yes. A pull. Uh, we call it a pull out bed. Uh huh. Have one. Hold on a second. I'll I'll, sh I'll show you. I'm actually uh, correct about this. So if we play a say a pull. You'll see what I what I mean of, of how it how it looks. Pull out the sofa bit. Mm -hmm. uh, here's a picture if I can if I can put it here. Uh, sure, maybe like like this. Here's a picture. I have to paste it. Mm hmm. I see. It's a little bit different when, when we say pull out. When we use the idiom to pull out, uh, we you have to pull it out. It's it's I don't know how how these Soviet ones <laughs> how how they work, but to me they're always flat. I don't know if it's something you 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 use as a mm -hmm. traditional couch. Mm -hmm. So the the couch, the first one I showed you, you know. We use that for a living room, right? Living room, and then you have your your coffee table, right? Your coffee, mm -hmm. uh, coffee table, and mm -hmm. then a TV or something, or maybe some sort of um, some sort of table, not not table, but some sort of wall wall stand, we'll say. Uh, but in 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 old Soviet styles. Nobody would even have a coffee table. Is that correct? That it's not really common to have a coffee table. Mm -hmm. We we have uh, no, uh, not uh, maybe uh, value yes uh, of uh, flat. It's uh, very small, mm. and uh, it is uh, no place which uh, we uh, we can put it put the coffee table. Yeah, yeah. I I see. Like, I'll I'll give I give you a picture here, uh, for instance. 
You know, but I I don't know. I, I don't like if Ukraine would copy our North American style because I, I don't, I think it should be unique. I mean, here's a picture here. All right, so uh, a, a love seat, a, a love seat is two chairs together. One second, I, I just opened it. Uh-huh, uh, I see. And how, 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 how it's named? Uh, uh, with two chairs, like two two uh, two seat sofa, we call it a love seat. Mm -hmm. A love seat. Mm -hmm. right. I see. I see. And and then you have your uh, recliner, the one that uh, or or, or, or a, a, a lazy boy. I I've never seen a lazy boy in in uh, in in Ukraine. So I'm gonna very quickly here. Put the uh, the image right here. There's an image for you. I I call this a, a lazy boy. What I don't know what you call this in 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 Ukraine. Lazy man? I don't know. Mm. Uh, maybe it's called. Uh, uh, one second. It. Uh, armchair. Um. Armchair. Mm hmm. There's another picture right here to see what I mean. Do you see this picture? Um, it's like a messenger, um, messenger armchair. A a massager. No, I, I don't know. Maybe some of them have a massager. But in Canada, you know, you know, we we, we like in North America, we we like these type of um, lazy boys. They're very comfortable. Yeah, you mean a uh, very big uh, armchair? Uh, armchair, yes. A recliner, uh, yeah. A recliner means it, it goes back. Uh huh. It goes back. Uh -huh. it goes okay. back. And 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 your your feet are are leveled. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. Some yeah. people can sleep all day. Mm -hmm. Okay. What else do we see about the, this living room? So fireplace too. I don't know any Ukrainian place that or an apartment that has a fireplace. In the Soviet days, they they never gave anyone a fireplace, did they? No. A fire fireplace. A fireplace. It's uh, on the picture. No. Yeah, it's there. It's at the back. Mm hmm. I see. And I see only uh, you know. Uh, uh, I see some people in the uh, trade center which advertise some uh, some kind of uh, M chair, and um, uh, I don't uh, I didn't see it in home uh, of people. Well, m most Ukrainian people. I mean, if you have a one room flat, forget about it. You're not, <laughs> you're not gonna have uh, a anything, right? But I mean, if you have a two room flat, you have what? That you have a uh, a bedroom. And mm -hmm. in the living room. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. And I had one student. He said, I, I have a three-room apartment. Uh, he said, no, a three-room flat. He says, I have uh, one bedroom, one toilet, one mm -hmm. living room. So he included the toilet as a room. So it was for me, it was, it was very funny. Because if you have a one-room flat, I asked him, is your... Toilet next to your bed, you know. Mm -hmm. it's, it's, mm -hmm. It was like a joke, you know. So, mm -hmm. so I, I suppose uh, having a, a living room, a two-room flat, maybe you have more room, right? But what else do you see in this picture? I see, I see a piano too. I see a piano, um, oh. and and pot lights and old old Soviet-style flats. I guess mm -hmm. they don't have any any pot lights. Do you know you you understand what pot lights mean? Do you? Pot light. Uh, pot. I don't know what is it. Pot. Uh, lights in the ceiling. Okay, let me check it. Mm -hmm. Pot light. You, you mean uh, what do you mean? It's like a. Uh, um, how to say it? Not a lamp uh, on on the. It's in like the uh, repeat, please. Uh, uh, light. 
Lights in the ceiling. Uh huh. Okay. Up, up there. Mm hmm. What else? Pictures in 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 the Soviet flags. Do people put pictures on their wall, or is, is I guess I guess that's common, right? No. It's hard to say. Uh, I, I just uh, see two two type. It's like um, you, you know um, yeah, on the. Uh, uh, so, 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 um, we have a flat lamp, you, you know, it's like on, on the um, on this uh, how to say the field, no, closer uh, on the plane, yes, mm -hmm. uh, and uh, uh, we have a, a, a lot of uh, funny lamps. Uh, um, I think it's uh, it's like in, 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 from the Soviet period, yes, it, because it look uh, very bad. Well, I I don't know. I mean, th this flat I'm in is Soviet. What do you, what do you call this big thing behind me? What do you call this big? We we call it some sort of. I don't know what you call it in English. You see it behind me. Uh, repeat, please. I don't uh, hear you. What 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 do you see behind me here? You see this big big jalopy thing, this big wooden. Look at this thing. It's huge. Mm -hmm. What 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 do you call this? Um, uh, I know it's like a, a wall, maybe you know, uh, wall stenka in Russian. I don't know. You, we don't have this in Canada like that. Like like in in a dining room, we have. Uh, one dining cupboard for for dishes, uh, mm -hmm. for cups, shop, uh, no, sh shashka, shashka, right, shashka. I, mm -hmm. I, I say shopka by mistake. You know, I gotta watch what mm -hmm. I say. Uh, mm -hmm. And and different things. But in this one, there's everything is in here. Clothes in one in them, books in the other, sh shashka in the other. It's like three in one, right? Mm -hmm. In North American dining room, you have the the plates for in a dining cupboard. Right, mm -hmm. so it's it's it, it, this is if you have this in the Soviet days, you're very rich, I think. <laughs> what about? Yeah. Go ahead. Yeah. Yeah. Uh, you you need to have a lot of books and uh, yeah. cups and cups. Uh, I don't know how to say it. Uh, Glassware, maybe. I don't know. Special glass, yes. Uh, Special glass. What about the carpet? Uh, what kind crystal, of Soviet carpet? Uh, crystal, uh, crystal, uh, crystal uh, glass, you know. Crystal, crystal glass, or china, china wear. I don't know if you had china wear back, uh -huh. back in the day. What about carpet? I see a lot of people. They they have a carpet on the wall. <laughs> mm -hmm. <laughs> it's like the, uh, you know, in the internet, it's very funny pictures. A lot of very funny pictures. With 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 a carpet on the wall on the background. Yeah, I I have a picture. One second, like this. I'm I'm referring. Uh, not ni nice nice looking girl, but it's kind of nice looking carpet too. Here's a picture. Tell me what you think of this picture. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> the the wall matches the floor. Mhm. Mm mhm. Mm uh, it's like uh, turn, uh, how to say it, turn uh, around flat, uh, you know. Tur turned around. Yes, yes. But but why why put a carpet on the wall? What what was the message behind that? I know. Why? I don't understand why though. Jaho. <laughs> it's hard to say. Uh, maybe it's. Uh, uh, it's like status uh, symbol, you know. A symbolic or some yeah. style. Mm -hmm. uh, interesting. I have yeah. a, I have yeah. a picture for you. Maybe you can tell me more about this picture. One second. What do you see? What do you see in this picture? It's the same, I think. It's a, oh. Yes. Yes, I didn't. Oh um, no. I didn't. Uh, one second here. One second. Uh, I I um. 
I posted the thing. Okay, there you go. Mm-hmm. Mm. It's, uh, you mean a refrigerator or what? It's like um, a flat with uh, with a um, uh, how to say it? It's like with the symbol of a uh, Soviet period. Yes. This is 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 it's a real. So I I remember this refrigerator in Canada. Old my Ukrainian neighbor had a refrigerator like that. Mm-hmm. And it, 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 it worked for 50 years. More. Mm -hmm. and, but it, it's not, I don't think it's Soviet. Because we had refrigerators like that in Canada, similar. If you mm -hmm. open it up, there's a freezer inside. Mm -hmm. But they, they took a lot of energy. What I else? Don't know. I, I, I remember it um, it's make a lot of sound. Yeah. Oh, yeah. The no, 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 noise, noise. The, it's yeah. The compressor is very noisy. We could say. Mm -hmm. yeah. mm -hmm. What else do you notice in the picture that makes it the Soviet look? What else do we see? On this picture. Yeah. Mm, I think uh, all uh, it's like a special picture, uh, w which uh, people make a Soviet period of that. What about radio? Soviet radio? Yes, yes. It's like, um, you know, transistor. It's called transistor in the Soviet period. A, a transistor radio? Yeah, transistor. Yes, radio. yes. Not, not yes. a, not a tube, tube radio. Mm -hmm. and, and they, they had a, a rosetta for radio. Can you tell me about this? Uh, so, like, um, this, uh, they had a special rosetta for for radio. No. Uh, uh how, how how it's called uh, in English? Uh out out outlet outlet mm -hmm. uh, yes uh, in in flat we have um, a special outlet uh, for radio and I don't know why it's uh, it's like uh, from from the Soviet period you know uh, whereas people have it only one radio <laughs> flat it's, uh, and have not uh, TV set. So radio was very important for people. Mm -hmm. right? Yes, it's used like a, a clock um, because uh, they uh, sing uh, songs uh, in the morning and in the evening. Because in, in Canada in the 1940s and the 1950s, people used to sit around the radio mm -hmm. before the television. Mm-hmm. And uh, well, in in Canada, we started watching TV in the 1940s, right? But you know, a lot of people, I mean, there weren't many TV shows, right? I mean, they had mm -hmm. black black and white TV, and then in the 50s, they had color. Color television just came out in the 1950s, and uh, you know, American people they like their put their we call it a rab rabbit ears. Mm -hmm. Rabbit ear uh, antenna, and because they never had cable TV, and everyone would, they only had a couple of channels in 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 color, just a couple. That's about about it. Mm -hmm. So in the Soviet time too, uh, no no television in the room, or no, that was not allowed. I think it's from mm, I don't know, maybe from sixty and uh, ninety sixties. Uh, people uh, have a lot of TV. Um, maybe sometimes 70s, yeah. Uh, 1970s, yeah. Maybe and people uh, start to buy a TV set, a lot of TV set. Black and white, correct? Yes, only black and white. Only black and white. Mm -hmm. And uh, there's another shelf here. It looks like some sort of a bookshelf and uh, a picture of Babushka, too, on this picture, too. What what about the wallpaper? What can you say about the wallpaper? Is it does it look a little bit that you can say it looks Soviet style? What what is what's different about this wallpaper than than modern wallpaper? The wallpaper. Uh, it's on the picture. Yes. Okay. Yes. Uh, I I don't see uh, in this picture. You mean? Yeah. We, 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 uh, it's like uh, how to say it? it's like um, 
Uzor one second. Uh, uh, it's like a design, a pattern, you a know. Pattern, a pattern. Pattern. I thought in the Soviet days they they didn't use wallpaper, no? Or 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 was it just uh, paint? Uh, could you repeat that one here? I thought maybe in the Soviet days they never used wallpaper but just paint. 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 You mean uh, uh, maybe uh, people? Uh, well, you could could you repeat? I don't I don't understand all of this. Answer. Well, in in the the moderate photo, right? Mm -hmm. The moderate one. This one here. Uh huh. Uh -huh. Right. It's painted like a blue color, right? Uh, I understand. It's like uh, we use uh, only, um, uh, how to say it, uh, uh, maybe paint, paint, yes. Uh, so. I, I, I think so. Am I wrong? Because it looked ugly. When I look at this, uh, like an ugly looking blue. Was, every, was it made to look ugly on purpose or was it an, a mistake? Uh, I think it's like uh, de design, maybe special design for, for this room. It's uh, very contrast uh, color, yes. Well, I I can see some of the original color, and it, it looked. I I could not live. I could not live uh, in this type of uh, place mm -hmm. if it was like a very, very ugly looking. That's the, <laughs> the only thing I can say. Mm -hmm. No. Maybe, uh, maybe uh, uh, I think uh, people. It's like um, sometimes people make uh, <laughs> it's like uh, things which uh, we we cannot understand. It's like uh, maybe red color for for the for for bedroom. Well, in Soviet, they I see in the picture with that girl sitting on the couch. They like red. Red is very important. Mm -hmm. Red, red's very important. But yeah. the, some of the designs, uh, they don't make sense. You know, like, I know today we, we use some sort of abstract design, but these designs, they, there is no design. It's just, I don't know what it is. I, I have to ask an expert, I guess. But it, to me, it has no, no, no design, no, no abstract about it. This is the okay. problem that I see. Uh, so in, in, Ucr in, in, in Ukraine... I mean, do you, do you think people will will go back to this old Soviet design? Do you think people want something uh, like American people have? Because, like I said, American people, uh, they they have bigger space. They have a bigger place to have all the furniture. You know well, what I mean? Yeah, you know, Michael, uh, you say uh, American people have a big, bigger place, yes? Yes. Uh, I, uh, I on, on the TV show I usually see see so so uh, the the flat is like uh, own houses uh, for people yes and maybe one or two uh, two um, uh, floors with, with one or two floors but uh, the rooms in, in rooms in these houses are very small with a low uh, uh, how does it uh, low uh, selling? Yeah. Yes. Well, the the living room should be the biggest. I mean, if you have a big if you have a big house, you have a cathedral ceiling. Cathedral ceiling is like thirteen feet ceiling up on the on the really really high ceiling. Mm -hmm. You know, but the uh, living room should be big. But yeah, bedrooms are the 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 biggest bedroom is mm -hmm. the master bedroom. Mm -hmm. uh, an ensuite. Uh, you know, you know the show Two and a Half Men, correct? Uh, show what? Two and a Half Men. Two and a Half Men. Oh, maybe I don't know. <laughs> with, with with Charlie Sheen. Charlie Sheen. No, I never. Mm -mm. Uh, an on. I'm, I'm trying an ensuite. I'm trying to show you what an ensuite is. Mm -hmm. uh, one second here. Oh, one second. On sweet uh, bathroom. If I spelt it correctly. So. Mm -hmm. 
here's a picture. So some in 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 America, some some bedrooms they have a bathroom that's connected to the bedroom. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm, I see. Uh, but but they have um, uh, maybe two bathrooms or three. That's right. Mm -hmm. That's, that yeah. picture there is just the room. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. Uh, it, it's like for owners uh, of the flat, you know. The the master bedroom. Uh -huh, master. Mm -hmm. master bedroom and and a uh, walk walk-in closet. In in the Soviet days, I guess that's that's your walk-in closet right there, right or, right over there. Mm -hmm. I I think it would be too small to have a walk-in closet. You understand mm -hmm. what I mean by walk? I'm, walk? I'm talking about like this walk-in closet, like this picture here. Um, talk like this. This is a walk-in closet. Did you ever? Was this? Did anyone have this in the Soviet days? I I don't know. Maybe you can answer this for me. Uh, it's like a, a wardrobe, yes. <laughs> a wardrobe. Wardrobe, yes. Wardrobe. What the about the rug? The rug. You see the uh, rug. Uh, right, rug. What is it? I don't know. Carpet. Ah. Mm-hmm. We call it. Wait. Okay, shag rug. Mm-hmm. Uh, shag, yeah. it, like, it looks like from a dog, like a, from a Subaka. Mm-hmm, mm-hmm, I see. Uh, was this, no, you never, this was not popular in the Soviet type of flats, or? Yeah, uh, we haven't uh, this uh, kind of uh, uh, carpet, but uh, we have, you know, yeah. Uh, with them, um, we, we have a lot of. Uh, uh, we had a lot of uh, carpets with them. Um, it's like a, um, with a pattern. Uh, it's like Turk, uh, not Turkish. You, you know, Indian or. Uh, I, I see. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I see that type of design. Mm -hmm. It's like a special design with 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 some thing. I don't know how how to name it uh, in English. Well, yeah. what's the what's the problem with having a shag rug? What do you think the problem with the shag rug? Shag rug is what you see. I don't remember. I I think it's uh, no no not uh, it's not very long time ago when we can start we can can uh, to buy it. It's uh, not ma it maybe it's not make uh, in our country. Probably China. Yes, yeah, but uh, yeah, okay. From China, we can uh, buy it uh, only maybe ten years. For ten years. For ten years. Mm -hmm. Well, I think I think with the shag rug, it's hard to clean. You know what I mean? Like uh, I think you can get a lot of lot of dirt in there. Maybe uh, <laughs> you you need to. Uh, it's like uh, for the you need um, a vinic. <laughs> no, no, one second. Like uh, mm, powerful, powerful uh, vacuum cleaner. Yeah. Now, what, what kind of vacuum cleaners in the Soviet days were? What kind of vacuum cleaners in the Soviet days were popular to use? Like I mean, now I see different ones. I see Samsung, LG. I see, uh, I see different stuff. Well, how was it back in the old days? Did, did you never use? Did they have vacuum cleaners or, or were they? Yes, yes I I remember uh, some of the uh, that uh, vacuum cleaner. It's like a, you know, it, 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 maybe you can see it. It's like a rocket. It's named <laughs> rocket. Uh, uh, and uh, it's like design. It's like a pipe, but short a pipe. Uh, like this. One second. Mm, something like that. Yes. I I I saw I saw something like that. Yeah, it, lo it looked like a nuclear weapon, small little nuclear weapon. <laughs> Yes. But they now now I mean 
You know, in in Canada, we have different vacuums than than in here. I don't know how to describe it, but a, a canister. What what the picture I showed is a canister. Uh, the the one, and then we have up upright upright. They go back and forth, back and forth. Like the the motor is all connected. Mm -hmm. And mm -hmm. I think in Ukraine the the vacuums are more they're more smaller. I mean sometimes the vacuum is as big as the flat, and mm -hmm. it's, it's hard to find out what the perfect vacuum is. So people end up using a V-neck, or they go and use a stick vacuum. Have you heard of a stick vacuum before? Stick. Um, stick vacuum. Mm, I don't know. Um, one second, I just check it. Stick vacuum. Mm -hmm. Here's a picture. Um, one second. I I don't know. I understand. But, uh, okay, I just open. Ah, uh, mm -hmm. I, I never see it in Ukraine. Never. No. Mm -hmm. mm. Because in Canada, we, we need we need big vacuums, you know. Mm -hmm. yeah, you know, only one time uh, I see uh, oh. something like that. Maybe you know Kirby. Uh, Kirby, you see, it's a famous uh, <laughs> company, which uh, which uh, produces sell. Uh, it's like very um, expensive uh, vacuum cleaner. Well, in, in North America, we have bigger, much bigger places, more carpet. Well, yeah, we have lots of carpet, so we need those big vacuums uh, mm -hmm. to, to clean like that. Some people have central air, no, central air, central vacuum, which mm -hmm. means uh, they have a lot of uh, like rosettes for, for the two. To go okay. all, all in the house, so we mm -hmm. call that central vacuum. Mm -hmm. But uh, now I'm starting to see steam cleaners. I know I don't think in the Soviet days they had steam cleaners to clean rug. Do you understand what a a steam cleaner is? Steam cleaners. Um, I don't know. <laughs> Do you have a picture? I have pictures. I always have pictures. Send it. <laughs> there you go. Ah, okay, and I, uh, I see the translation. It's like with uh, steam. Uh, mm -hmm. I never use it. I don't have uh, such kind of vacuum cleaner. Well, it wouldn't be worth it. I mean, on, on the Soviet rug, like here, I would be done in two seconds. In Canada, some people have rug all over their house, in the hallway, in the living room, in the dining room, in the upstairs, in the bedrooms. You know, it's a big, they can take a couple hours to clean. Here, two minutes and I can go, I can go to another babushka and clean her flat. You know? <laughs> so, mm -hmm. here's another picture too. Yeah, the, the vacuum cleaners, uh, I, I guess we're getting all this international stuff, right? But Ikea. Do we have an IKEA store in in Ukraine? Don't we? I don't know. I I you mean uh, yeah, IKEA uh, official IKEA store? I, I think <laughs> we don't. Like a like a like an official Apple store? Yeah, an, uh, IKEA. Yeah, I, I think I saw IKEA. No. Uh, repeat please. I think I saw an IKEA store. No, uh, uh, some people say me we, that we have uh, uh, IKEA store uh, with IKEA. Um, how to say it? Like, um, uh, maybe one second. Um, for furniture, yes. I think it looks like garbage. I don't know, but if I see any Ukrainian person buy from IKEA, I'm going to tell them I'd rather have Soviet furniture than IKEA. Well, <laughs> I, it, it, it's straight from Sweden. 
They give mm-hmm. you sweet. They have Swedish meatballs at their store. So I don't know, you know, what Swedish. Uh, what uh, Swedish? What meatballs? Uh, what is it? Like how to say in Russian? Uh, like cut, like a cutlet. Mm-hmm. Not so cut, but like a like a ball. Mm-hmm. Like what yeah. you find in spaghetti and pasta, right? But Swedish in Sweden they have their own traditional Swedish meatballs. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. So you you go shop at their store, and after you go try and their restaurant some Swedish meatballs. So mm-hmm. uh, what? what I, you- uh, I think uh, uh, you know IKEA. It's it's like uh, no um, no cheap, not expensive. Yes, it's cheap. It's cheap. Uh, the furniture, but in Ukraine we have a oh. uh, very expensive uh, furniture in, in this kind of shop. I, well, is it IKEA or not IKEA? IKEA, but but it, it's very expensive. And, and 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 do Ukrainian people do they buy this stuff? I mean, maybe they think, oh, we need to be like other people, and we need to buy all this IKEA stuff, so we're in fashion. Is that? Is that why they buy it, or I don't know? Maybe in Russia too. Is it is it very popular in in Eastern Europe? No, uh, I don't know. It's uh, we need to 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 speak about uh, about that with another people. But uh, um, if it, if it will be cheaper, you know, I think a lot of people will buy it because we have a very bad uh, furniture in in, in the. Uh, maybe as a shop, uh, as a, I think no no name shop, you know. Well, well, in the Soviet days, it was hard to get real wood. Uh, mm-hmm. To get this made, this is custom made. Uh, it took you had to wait four years to get it made. Four years. Mm-hmm, mm-hmm. But I think like back back maybe back in the day, things were made better. You know, solid wood. Instead of a particle board, uh, you know what particle board is, correct? Particle board, okay, right here. Yeah. Particle board. Mm. I check it in, in the translate. It's like that wood that's glued together. Mhm. And and this. Uh huh. Okay. Uh, particle board. Mhm. That that stuff causes cancer, you know, from what they say in Canada, right? Mm-hmm. It ca- it's the the glue in there. It can cause cancer, and uh, it's. I, I don't care about it. I think it's uh, cheaper, yes, uh, because uh, that it make uh, a lot of things with with the particle board. Yeah, of of course, sure. If if it was plywood to put plywood over it, it would be better. But usually they have a laminate, you know, mm-hmm. and and. Uh, uh, the laminate. There's two types of laminate. Either that cheap stuff or thermal, 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 thermal type of laminate. It's much stronger because uh, if you if you heat it up, you know that laminate, right? It, it will it will start to bubble. It it won't mm-hmm. be really good. But I I think in the Soviet days everything was hard wood. Am I correct? Hard wood. So Soviet period wood. Hard, hard wood. Everything was hard wood. Yeah. Yeah, um, you mean it's it's like one part of wood, wood yes? Sure. Yeah. yeah. As I remember, yes, we have a um, such kind of maybe table. You mean table or uh, um, some? How to say it is uh, um, for furniture and uh, furniture. I have I have this table here, you know. Look, if you look at this this table, it goes up up and down like, uh, you know, mm-hmm. it, it's like a cupboard, but it's like a dining room ta- table too. It goes mm-hmm. up, up and down. It, it's it, I never seen something like this in Canada. So mm-hmm. it, and, and usually they put some sort of uh, like a cloth or something on it, you know, and uh, make it nice and fancy. Mm-hmm. So it was all it 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 was all hard wood. All hard wood that they did, right? So now nowadays it's it's all this this cheap kind of looking particle board. Mm-hmm. And on the on the IKEA picture, on the on the IKEA picture, well, what what do you think? Does does it look cheap to you, or does it look like something that's moderate? 
Uh, I think uh, we have uh, uh, such kind of value uh, value of the Fed because uh, uh, in the picture uh, it look uh, okay. Uh, it look uh, no like a good flat. A, a lot of uh, books. Things. Yes, look and um, yes. A bookcase. Uh, well, look at the bookcase, eh? Uh, the Swedish people like books by the looks of it. Every 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 picture has lots of books. Mm -hmm. And <laughs> it's like a special design, yes. But, but uh, in the Soviet fight we have a lot of books too. It's like a status thing, yes? It's like uh, having having gold teeth too, eh? It's status. Uh, yes, yes. Uh, uh, the book was very expensive, yeah? And the people, it's like, if you have a lot of books, you are uh, uh, like... Uh, uh, how to say it? It's like no, no, um, maybe may a rich, no, not high rich, class. But high rich. class. Mm -hmm. Yes. Uh, a, a special type of books. Mm -hmm. <laughs> you, I don't think you'd find any English books back in those days. Mm -hmm. and, and in the picture too, we what do we call this? A, a lamp, a, a lamp shade, uh, standing, standing lamp shade. And in the shade, what is it? It's it's a, in Canada. It's really common to have a, a lamp that that stands up on its own. We have lots of lights. Uh -huh, in, the uh -huh. in the in the Soviet, how how it's just one light up there. That's all. Mhm. Uh -huh. I see. Um. Yeah. I think uh, it's not very popular because it's. Uh, uh, we have not um, a lot of place for for for, for this thing. And, and how how many tables usually would you have in in the in the Soviet flat? How many how many tables? Tables, maybe one per room. Just one table. Yes. For eating. Yeah, you mean oh, no? In in uh, in every room, uh, we have uh, one table maybe. Uh, in the kitchen, in the uh, living room, it's like a big, uh, but but uh, sometimes it's like a coffee table, little yes, uh, coffee table, uh, and uh, I don't know, maybe in the bedroom we have a uh, table, but uh, you have a shelf, not shelf, it's special, how to say it, a little uh, cupboard, how to say, uh, how to name it. What, what for for cups and stuff? No, it's for 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 maybe a clothes. Is, uh, oh, oh yeah, uh, not for a wardrobe, a closet. Uh, right, at least. Yeah. There's a closet. Mhm, mm mhm. Mm okay, yeah. Well, what what else am I missing, Miguel? A anything else? Look, I I'll send you one more picture. Mm -hmm. uh, old 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 fashioned. Because remember, I haven't been in Ukraine for that long to to know. Mm -hmm. I haven't been mm -hmm. in a lot of Soviet flats, so. <laughs> yeah. Yeah, yeah, yeah. It's uh, on this picture. It's funny. Uh, they have um. Uh, yeah, I don't know. Uh, a safe, yes. A safe, the safe. Yeah. It, it, wait a minute, people. It, they never had a safe before to put their money. No. <laughs> I no? don't know. I, I it's a uh, rare way to see this uh, safe uh, in, where, in the flat. Where did people hide their money? To the pillow. <laughs> yes. Yeah. That's the first place I would look if I was a, a, a burglar or a robber. Yes. Jeez. And w one more picture, too. It's from uh, depositphotos.com. Mm -hmm. it's, it's more of a professional photo. Mm -hmm. Okay, and what we have in this picture? We, we, have, we have some sort of cloth that's covered. Why, why do they put cloth? On the sofa, I don't understand. <laughs> uh, it's for protection. 
<laughs> yes, I think it's for protection and um, I have no idea. Uh, for, I think it's only for protection. It, it makes it look ugly, I think. Yeah, I don't know. <laughs> you know, uh, for, for protection or if you have a bad, um, how, to, how to name it, a bad material on, on, on this um, yeah, sofa. Oh, some linen, yeah, sure. Uh, some uh, linen. Uh, lemon. Lemon? Uh, uh, linen, I'll, I'll write it. Mm -hmm. uh, if it's not very, uh, um, it's like uh, not very, uh, uh, not quality. How to say? Um, it's not uh, good uh, quality. Yes. Okay, so it's not something in high quality. All right. You are like uh, put on it uh, some another material. Yes. Yeah, it's just it's just putting on a on a on a bed cover. One second, I just uh, answer uh, my phone. Okay, perfect. Yeah. Well, I, I wish I wish some people would would join here. I, I guess a lot of people from from Russia and Ukraine still live in a, a Soviet style flat, so it'd be interesting for people to to share what kind of what kind of flat they live in? What's in their Soviet flat? Maybe it's different than another Soviet flat that Babushka lives in. So it'd be very interesting for people to come in, tell us what how their flat is different than the old-fashioned days. Very interesting photos that we've been going through here. Very little chairs, books. Battery on here. The Michael chair. And and what about the chair? That chair, I think it's a little bit too small for an adult, don't you think? Or is that just about the right size? The chair in the photo. Do you see the chair? One second. Um, <laughs> uh, on the last uh, photo, yes. Yeah, yeah. Yeah, to, uh, what we can ch a special chair? It's it, like it looks like a chair for school. No, it's uh, it's called um, uh, uh, something like uh, uh, I don't know uh, Vienna. You know, uh, you know uh, the Austria capital, v Vienna. Mm -hmm. Why? Uh, yeah. How it's named? Vienna. Vienna. It's like Vienna's uh, chair. It's named. It's uh, it's like a special design for chairs. It's very. It was very popular. And I don't remember. Uh, maybe it's millions of these uh, chairs. These kind of chairs. Uh, produced by factories. Yeah. I see. I see. Well, yeah. what, what, what about in, in the bathroom? Uh, in, in the old Soviet bathroom, what, I, I think they just had one one big tub. How was it different than today? They never had any showers. No shower. Shower? Uh, what, uh, what is a shower? I don't know. I'll, I'll post it to you. One mm -hmm. second. Here's a picture. Got a picture. Mm. Mm -hmm. uh, you mean uh, uh, the shower, uh, but not uh, uh, how, how, how it's named? Uh, one second. Um, um. Uh, oh. It's like a special bathroom. It's like subject. Yes. I, I, well, either you have a bath or you have a shower. Luba, are mm -hmm. you there? Uh, mm -hmm. Hello, hello, Michael. Hello. <laughs> I'm here. I'm so <laughs> sorry for being so late. I was a little bit busy today. That's okay. That's right. So we're, we're we're talking about before and now. You know the old Soviet style and what's different from today. 
and we're talking about we were just talking about showers right you know uh, I don't know if you see this picture you know I obviously you know what uh, the difference between a shower and a bath is correct bathtub okay just a second uh -huh. I will download it okay yes yes I see it's a modern one but in the Soviet days they never had this a shower no or you never would see this um like like this uh, oh, oh, do you mean uh, the shower the, itself uh, or the cabin on, on, on the shower with, without bathroom yeah only the shower um best best um so we we had something like this but it wasn't so 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 uh exotic <laughs> so to say i don't know <laughs> Here's a Soviet bathtub. What do you think of this? It's a special bus for uh, military, no? <laughs> for sailor, uh, yes. <laughs> I, I I think if I go in that, it, it's going up in the air. Mm -hmm. <laughs> that, that, yes, yes. Ro like a rocket, yes. Like a rocket. <laughs> the rocket bath. <laughs> <laughs> wow, I don't know. It's pretty rusty, but nice on the inside. Mm -hmm. but that, uh, I think it's made from the bomb, something like that. <laughs> uh, for for uh, sea bomb. Uh, maybe I don't, they took, uh, it could be from the Bass region. They, had, they took something and carved it in, but I mm -hmm. don't know. I don't know, but that's a bathtub. I mean, uh, a luba. Uh, you mm -hmm. know, usually, um, am I right? But uh, your sink was the bathtub in Soviet apartments. Is that correct? Usually, you understand what I mean? Sink with the bus. Your sink, your your uh -huh. your sink was mm -hmm. the uh, and it was the bathtub too. Do you understand what I mean? Bus tube. Bus tube. What is this? Bus tube. Bus tube. What? What does it mean? Find a picture. I'm trying to find a picture here. It's like, how do I ex explain this? Uh, like, like, like this. No. Um. No. Like, like, like this. You. I, what I meant is, uh, the. How do you say this? The. Mm -hmm. Ah, uh huh, uh huh. Yes, you yes, have, yes. You have yes, to share, you know, like it's, it's a little bit different. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. Yes, it was. It was so, and uh, in some some old flats, it's it's the same till nowadays. I would say. Probably, so, yes. so do most people who upgrade their flat? Do they do they put no new Soviet rug down, or do they want something that's more modern? So it depends on financial situation. So if a person can allow some modern, um, why not? Of course, it's it's more convenient. It's more beautiful. But in some so. flats, there are still some babushkas. I'm sure they have. <laughs> Some bathroom uh, like this, yes. <laughs> no. Uh, Luba, could you repeat who who says? Babushka, no. Yes, in some babushka flat we can find something like yeah. this. Okay, I see. So as for me, it's uh, um, it's much better if so. It it doesn't it um, doesn't matter if it's uh, modern or not. The main thing it's it's clean, it's tidy. And it's the best. Yeah, yeah, because you know, I I don't believe in copying. I want to see something unique. You know what I mean? Like, uh, I I don't like IKEA. We I think there's an IKEA in Russia. There there has to be an IKEA, right? You know what IKEA? Mm -hmm. is, right? Yes, yes. Mm -hmm. and, and, you know the problem is in Eastern Europe, everyone sees. Oh, look at those people. They have this. We're gonna buy it too. We'll put it in our flat. But it's junk. It's all like you have to put it together yourself. You know, you have to screw everything. Put this here. Put that there. Uh, mm -hmm. it, it's not ready, ready made. It's it, you have to. It's like 
what, what do we have? Pre, pre-assemble. Pre-assemble uh, stuff. So it's junk. So I, I hope that people in Eastern Europe, Ukraine, Russia, Belarus, every, all these countries, I, I hope they don't say that, hey, this is really good stuff. I think it'll last a hundred years. I hope that's not the attitude. Uh, but, Michael, what does it mean, junk? Uh, could you please write this word? Junk? junk. I, I said junk. Uh, junk, junk. Mm -hmm. But I, I, I have a picture, no, wrong picture, of the IKEA. What do you what do you what do you think of IKEA? What do you think? What is it? Is it? Do you think it's junk? Uh, junk. Uh, Garbage. Luba, you know Musa. It's Musa. Uh, Musa, junk. Musa. Oh, okay. Thank you. Um. Uh, no, no, it's uh, Michael. It's not uh, junk because we have a lot of. Uh, furniture uh, more it's like wor wor worse uh, than uh, worse condition <laughs> worse condition is, uh, uh, than in a IKEA uh, and it's like a, um, uh, not usual it's like a, um, popular maybe very popular thing it uh, it's uh, pl placed in a lot of flats. Yeah, I think it's not very bad. <laughs> if people uh, can buy only this, I mean, uh, it's not a very expensive. And people can yes. buy. Yes, yes, yes. I would, I would mm -hmm. like to say the same that uh, we can find there in IKEA shops. We can find a lot of uh, different things or for different tastes, and it costs. Not a lot of mm -hmm. money. For, for, for us in Canada, it, it's, it's all the same. It's all the same. I, I want to see something different, like like English Home. You know that store, English Home? Miguel, you saw English Home. English what? English Home. Home? I it's don't know. Magazine. What, what do you mean? Uh, my, I don't know. It's in the malls. It's in Dreamtown, right? Uh, I never been. I see it uh, on the street, but I uh, don't uh, go into the uh, into this uh, mall. mall. Mm -hmm. You see, you know this store I'm talking about. It's called English Mall. No, no, no there isn't. Um, there aren't any such shops in our region. No, I haven't seen. It's like old-fashioned with quality, solid wood. Babushka quality, you know, not this <coughs> vertical board stuff. Plastics. I think plastics are not good for children, you know? Yeah, plastics can be very harmful. A lot of chemicals in plastics. Mm -hmm. my, my neighbor, my Ukrainian neighbor, would never drink from plastic, always glass. Mm -hmm. I don't know. And, you know, some drinks taste different in plastic than they do in glass. The, the taste changes. So maybe but there are some some special there are some special plastic for um, for for ch children's dishes. Yes, it, it's very expensive, but it's it's. I, I hope that it's um, not harmful. Hmm. Well, I, I I'm I'm very traditional, very traditional. I believe mm -hmm. quality over quantity, and I and I like old old-fashioned stuff. I want to see things that you can't buy every day. You know? Make make it unique. Mm -hmm. and, it, and it's really hard to define that these days because, you know, if every country had the same things, what would be unique about the world? Right? <laughs> that's, that's why I like to see the Soviet rug on the, uh, on the, on the wall. I think that's unique. You know, it's, it maybe mm -hmm. for some people mm -hmm. it doesn't look nice, but I I think it, it has its own. It's a it's a ninch. What do you think? A ninch. Could you write, please? Mm -hmm. A ninch. Mm -hmm. It's like a specialty, you know. Uh huh. But if if I'm not mistaken, uh, there are some like, uh, oh, how is it? Uh, markets, not markets, marked. Uh, uh, Oh, how is it in English? 
uh, who marked us. So it's a marked where people uh, sell old things for for good price and like antiquariat. Commission maybe magazine. I, I mean by us it calls machine rinak done but it in in European countries it's very popular and there are not bad things I would say. Well, look look, look so at the picture I sent you. Did you see the last picture? This is a woman's bathroom. You can tell. The last picture? Okay. So it's a bathroom, yes? Yeah. But, th but this style is very contemporary English style. Looking at the cupboard and everything and looking at the design of the bathtub. Very different. You won't see that at, at Ikea. If you see that at, at, at Ikea, I'll give you $100. You'll never find that at Ikea because it's too mm -hmm. cheap to have it. That's what I mean. You know, that kind of that class, that, that Royal Dalton, Swarovski Crystal. Hey, Miguel, hey, Swarovski Crystal, you know... Has to have some sort of class, so that's what I look for. So my next apartment will have a nice, so a nice Soviet rug on the ground. I, I wanna, I want something with uh, prestige. You know, that's what I want. What do you mm -hmm. think, Mama? Luba? Uh, can you repeat, please? Something was wrong with with uh, my connection. I, I, I said my next flat will have to be something unique, so I'll have a big Soviet rug, ah. a mm -hmm. big Soviet mm -hmm. rug on, on on the bottom there. What do you think of that? Um, so it, it would be a good idea if uh, rug is is in good quality. Why not? Why not? It's very yes, unique. I'm thinking. I don't know. Like like this. Like this. Why not? What's wrong with this? Luba, you tell me. Uh just a moment I will open this link. Ah, mm -hmm. There are <laughs> a lot of such such carpets in in our flats. Yes. I'll, I'll put it on the ceiling. <laughs> on the ceiling. Up up there. Hang it down, eh? I don't know. It, it's it's different, you know. So in Canada, we have a lot of uh, Vic Victorian style houses, and mm -hmm. we have a special design, special way. So I'm always interested in something unique, and uh, from time to time, I'll share some photos. I just go to the store. I go to the store. I see a lot of unique stuff because I think in in Ukraine. Here they, they try to copy from other countries, you know, and that's the thing. So it's not not the best, but you know, it's something unique. But of course, IKEA and and uh, and, and JISK. We have a JISK. J no J Y S K. Have you heard of JISK too before? Mm -hmm. No. It's it's like a chain of uh, shops. Yes. It's garbage again. Have you been? You been in the uh, Jisk, Luba? Jisk. Jisk in in Russian. Jisk. In Russian, how is it in Russian? I didn't hear about that. It's, it's, it's usual came Jisk, I think. Jisk. I didn't even hear that word. If I'm honest, it's maybe some kind of dialect. No, it's a chain. Of, uh, it's like network of shops. Mm, I don't know. Bedding for, yeah, for different mm -hmm. stuff and like cloths and stuff. And it's we have this mm -hmm. in Canada too. My mother says it's not it's not her type of class. You know, my mother is like uh, from the woman from Veronica. Right, so you know, to, to to have that type of level, it has to be up, up, way up high. So she she will never buy anything from Jisk or IKEA per se, right? So I don't know, never, 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 never. Anyways, it's it's eight oh five, Luba. I I wish you came earlier. You know, I I I wish, but there's always there's always next Thursday, and I have a, another lesson after this, so. I will have to, to cut it short. Luba, <laughs> Luba, you, 
You should have came early. It was, it was fun. We had a lot of pictures in the beginning to compare between the old Soviet-style uh, apartments and now. So, you know, it's, it's interesting because, you know... Yes, it's, it's very pity that I have missed today's lesson. Okay, and, you, you can join the uh, next lesson. <laughs> Maybe you can uh, go to the lesson at 6.30. Uh, <laughs> well, the next topic will be right to bear arms with uh, with guns. You know, so that's the next topic there for for next week. So, uh -huh. in, in Canada, in, yes, yes, in Canada, in Canada, in, Can in Canada, I, I don't, th I think you need a license. In American states, it's okay. You can you can have a, a bazooka gun. It doesn't matter. Anything you want. But we'll be talking about that. We'll be talking about that next for next lesson on next Thursday at uh, 7 o'clock Kiev time, 8 o'clock mm -hmm. Moscow time. Alright, mm -hmm. so I'm going to end this up, or wrap it up for I'll say. So, for Luba and Miguel, uh, thanks for, for being here. Uh, mm -hmm. Please, please, don't go to Ikea. I, I, I hate this. It's, 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 who's this? Who's this? Okay. So, everyone, have a good evening and don't be too cold. <laughs> Bye-bye. Thank you. Thank you, Michael. Goodbye. Goodbye.